All right, now that we've learned the basics of one point perspective, like you only have three lines, vertical, horizontal, or a diagonal that goes to the vanishing point, and that you need parallel lines, like this one to the edge of your page and to each other, it's time to start making our city. So here's some examples. This is a fifth grade one that a student did in the past. Very nicely done. Here's one that I've done in the past. It's got a lot of details on it. And to begin, the first thing we need to do is just make the road. The first day that we work on these in class, all we're going to do is try to get the road done. Okay, a road and sidewalk. So, first thing is horizon line. And again, I'm just looking for that rectangle or those parallel lines. That looks pretty close. Draw that. Add the vanishing point. And I'm going to make a mark right here, about right here. Just gives me something to aim for. And this is going to be my road. Okay, so there's the road. We're going to put in the sidewalk and just make it a little bit further on the outside of these lines for your road. You don't want it too wide. Okay, and there's your road and your sidewalk. Um, the sidewalk will look more realistic if we add those lines or the cracks in the pavement. So what I like to do is actually use my straight edge like this so I can do both of them at the same time. And it's nice that you can see through it too. So again, has to be parallel to the edge of your paper, not to the side of your road or your sidewalk. So I'm looking either at my, my horizon line or the top of my paper or the bottom is probably the easiest because um, you can see it through this straight edge. And looks good. So just add those two first cracks and move it up a little bit. Check the rectangle good and as things get farther away they get smaller and smaller as you can see the sidewalk is getting smaller and the road and they get closer together but you also lose some detail so about right here I'm gonna start making these a little closer together and maybe only making like partial lines. So you can see it's sort of a broken line. It's just because when things are that far away, your eye cannot pick up those details. Again, I'm always checking to make sure I have those parallel lines. And eventually, I'm just going to stop putting lines in. Maybe do one more. And that's it. I'm going to stop right there because as it goes further and further away, you just can't see those lines. Okay? So I've got my sidewalk done. If you have time, you can put in the center lines of the road. I know a lot of people like to do that. Um, so you can have it just be two solid lines. That's obviously the easiest way. I'm just checking for the center. So 
So I'm just, I'm not going to even make it a dashed line. Mine are going to be two solid lines. Like that. That's the center lines of our road. Um, and that's what we're going to try to get done the first day we work on these.